To everyone, it's quite the challenge to reveal their truth, which is really hard, me especially. Hello, my name is Cody and I have autism. Until the age of eight, I was non-verbal, unable to speak or use speech as communication. During those times, I found it very difficult to communicate, being in groups with people as I grew scared of loud noises and being in rooms full of people. I saw life through a tunnel vision. After many years of sweat and tears, I was brought up as a regular person who could speak, interact, and be in groups of people. We are all the same, blank canvas that are painted with our own differences. We are all that separates the world from being boring. My name is Shanaya. My story is about the state, the state, disabled. One day there was a kid who had a disability and he can't walk when he was little. His mum was sad, but she was so happy to have a son too. He's doing good and he's love his family. The boy known as Dean is a story about a boy that was born with a cripple disease. This is my story. My mum and I were very sick. I soon discovered that I loved running and that I was very good and I am proud to say never, say never. Hi, my name is Ryan. My old ADHD and learning difficulties from when I was born, I write so because I cannot write, write fast enough. I find it hard to concentrate. I used to have medication, but it didn't really work for me. We have strategies to calm me down and to keep me going. Take deep breaths, I would go to my room and chill on my bed. We talk about things and support each other. My name is Blake and my disability is receptive language disorder. I did not speak till I was two, so I had my own sign language. So mum and dad sent me to speech therapy. But in preschool, I still could not say my sounds properly. Then in kindergarten, I started stuttering. I went back to speech and it was an anxiety problem. And we found out I have fine and gross motor skills issues. Hi, my name is Molly. Since birth, my brother has had Jacobson syndrome and trisomy 9P. My superior is my brother because of his strength he puts out in the world and the kindness and no matter what's going on, he always stays positive and happy. My family and I always stick together when the stuff becomes hard and just remember that we have each other and remember it gets better. One in a million. I have a sister with a disability. She's 14, but with the mental age of four to five years old. My sister is unable to read or write, but enjoys school and is happy and fun to be with. Early on in her life, my sister had to have several operations. This was the start of my anxiety and depression. My sister has autism spectrum disorder and epilepsy, and she's a one in a million. Hi, I'm Amy Scholl, and I'm going to be talking about my brother, who has ADHD and autism. He's completely obsessed with video games. But he knows every little detail about the, his favorite game at the moment. My brother is one of the most energetic and most lovable people you will ever meet. My brother is amazing. And no matter how many people will try to change him, he doesn't need to change and he won't change.